All right, so I survived the night and it's 7.56. That's crazy because I usually do not get out at 7.56. So I'm usually out like at like 7.30 maximum, like 7.25. But the reason that I, the reason why I stay like till 7.56, the, it's because the person that was supposed to be replacing me was running late and I had to stay like for half an hour, you know, to um, actually wait for her and then give a report because you cannot just like go in. Um, take care like of people overnight and just live like that because you gotta like say what you did and what happened to the shift So that's the reason why you know, I'm kind of like living at a specific time now But yeah, that's been much all about it. So I find out that my pay is gonna be different So apparently like I'm full-time. So it's just gonna be like um My regular pay with like half of my regular pay So I generally don't know how it's gonna turn out But I did not even think about this when I was picking up this shift But apparently that was kind of like a good deal, you know Because I generally did not have anything to do home To do at home besides of studying So I just took this shift and kind of like planned my day The way that I did But I'm glad that I did it the way that I did Because, you know, there's something out of it but other than that, I'm heading to the gym now because I got to work out today, even if it's like for one hour. And I'm going to buy some supplies that I need to do a lab, a biology lab assignment. And I'll just like sleep and wake up again and go on my other 12 hour shift, which is going to be for later at like 7 again. So it's like literally like less than um, 11 hours and a half type thing. But that's pretty much it.